Well, Missouri Governor Mike Parson announced today phase one of his show me strong recovery plan will last longer than expected. He said phase one, which includes social distancing requirements, is going to continue now through June 15th. It's not over. Our Missouri Capitol Bureau reporter Jeff Bernthal is in Jefferson City with a look at why the governor is now delaying phase two. The governor said based on the data his administration has been analyzing, he believes the state is doing a good job in terms of fighting COVID-19. We are extending phase one not because Missouri has taken a step back, but because we want to make sure we are fully prepared for phase two. The governor was asked if the weekend scenes from the Lake of the Ozarks were a factor. He said no. The governor said a big part of the decision to extend the order involves the fact the St. Louis and Kansas City areas are facing bigger challenges than more rural parts of the state. And June 15th is when current executive orders are set to expire. The current state order includes restrictions on how many customers can enter a business based on building size and includes a six-foot social distancing requirement unless performing a job that requires closer contact with individuals. Extending phase one to June the 15th aligns us with our executive orders as well as the state of emergency in Missouri. Additionally, some communities across the state are further along than others when it comes to reopening and economic recovery. Extending the order will give us give these communities more time to prepare and align with us at the state level as we continue working towards phase two. One thing that's been clear is that there has been little enforcement about social distancing guidelines. The governor again repeated that he believes that is up to local authorities. He said he does not expect the state to be monitoring how far people are standing apart. Reporting from our Capitol Bureau in Jefferson City, I'm Jeff Bernthal.